Hello, my name is Colin Campbell. I'm with Polygon. You're looking at Lake Ridden. Sophia! Where are you? I'm so sorry! It's a first person puzzle adventure, and in a moment we'll find out from the protagonist what the story is all about. Alone out here in the middle of the night. Please let her be okay. Still haven't caught up with Sophia, but I keep finding her things everywhere, so I know I'm on the right track. I should have checked in on her sooner. Leaving her things where they are, so we'll find our way back. Good thing for Sophia that I'm such a great tracker. So you're Marie, who has to go out into these creepy woods to find uh, Sophia, your younger sister. Um, it's being developed by a Malmo-based indie called Midnight Hub. They feature some developers from Mojang, Paradox and Massive. As you can tell, it's a first-person exploration game in the style of Gone Home and Firewatch, which they name as Inspirations. And, you, if you've played Firewatch, you can definitely see uh, the similarities here as you're sort of walking down these kind of very nicely illustrated corridors, uh, just looking for stuff, looking for stuff that pulls the story together and that allows you to progress through fairly straightforward puzzles. Um, the use of this flashlight might make you think there's a horror element to it. As far as I can tell, it's mostly about atmosphere and creepiness. There are no sort of nasties looking to track you through this dark group, at least not in this early part of the game. I'm not going to talk too much during this demo, it's about 10 minutes long, it gives you a good sense of what the game's all about, but I think you'll get more of a sense of it just by enjoying what's going on. So I'm going to sort of sign off now and leave the rest of the video just to run itself. Uh, Lake Ridden is coming out next year on PC. One step at a time, you can do this. Calm and easy. <sighs> okay. No, 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 no! on her I'm gonna <clears throat> I just found an old dirt path that will be able to follow back to the main road someone will be sure to drive by I'd rather avoid the teens that turn this place upside down. 
It looks quiet right now, but you never know when they'll be back. Did they just leave all this trash here? Oof, it really stinks in here. Pretty weak. Just need something heavy to smash it with. 